Hey guys, what's up? It's editing Momo from the future. Sorry, I look a mess, but I just wanted to hop on here and say a few things. Um, one, I recorded this video a while back, uh, back when like lockdown had recently kind of just started. Um, and since then, a lot has been going on, as you probably already know, um, with the protests and whatnot. And I just really wanted to say that black lives do indeed matter. If you are someone that goes by the whole all lives matter thing instead of black lives matter thing, just understand that we understand that all lives matter. We agree that all lives matter, but right now black lives are the ones that are being oppressed and not included in that all in all lives matter. And that's what we are fighting for. We are fighting to make black people included in that all in all lives matter. And I think that's what people aren't getting. I'm not sure if that's what it is, um, but I am going to leave a bunch of links in the description. Um, of ways you can help or donate or, or or just information whatever I can find I'll put down and if you have any links that you can contribute in the comment section I would be very grateful for it and yeah we just need to do better we need to stand up for each other we need to just use their voice for those who don't have one because there are ignorant people out there and it needs to stop and we need to start treating people the right way and treating black lives like they do matter. If you really believe that all lives matter, then act like it and you should be angry too. If you believe all lives matter, then you should be angry for your black community too and help do what's right. So yeah, um, here's the video. Links are in the description. Please contribute any links if you have any. Thank you. What's up you guys? It's Momo. Sorry for this weird angle. You are propped up on a plushie. I'm very grateful for your service. But today I am finally showing you guys my charm collection um, that goes for official art, or official merch, and fan merch, fan art merch. And I'm gonna just go ahead and start and show you guys everything in order by series. I have quite a lot and I'm pretty sure that I have some that I missed but I can't fine right now uh, but so far what I have is a lot anyway <laughs> alright so I'm gonna start with the magical girl charms and I'm specifically gonna start with the Tokyo Mew Mew charms I'm gonna start with the fan art ones apologize I do not remember all the artists I bought these from because I have a lot of charms and I bought these like a while back um, but anyways if you know any of the artists please don't hesitate to put it in the comments and I will see it and I will I'll try to add it into the description as well all right so the first one is of Mew Ichigo and it is this adorable charm right here and she has Masha at the top of her head a little heart charm right there I really hope this focuses I think there's a glare and I apologize greatly for that but if I hold it back there we go so yeah, there's that one, and I think this is one of my favorites. Um, this is also one of my favorite artists. I usually see them at cons. I don't remember the name, but like when I see the style, I know it's them. Um, I also have a Sailor Moon one uh, similar to that, or a Chibi Moon one, which we'll get to later. Next up, I have this artist charm, and it is of Ichigo and Kish. What I love about this is I love the fact that Kish is in it, but not only that, but I love Ichigo's hair and pigtails, and I love when she has the pigtails and she's in her school uniform and she has like the cat ears pop up randomly. It's the cutest thing ever, and as you can see, it is right there. Alright, next one, I think the artist of this is Pretty Pastel Studios. I want to say that's the one, but I'm not. 100% sure but it is another new Ichigo and she is holding her strawberry bell while she is covered in chocolate <laughs> I remember the artist being really sweet I remember when I got this I got this at a con I don't remember which one I believe it was Asin and I bought this charm and I looked back at it later and I thought it was scratched up because I was trying to peel off the film and like I couldn't peel it so I'm like oh no maybe there's no protective film so I went back to her and she like peeled it off for me and I felt really dumb but she was really nice about it. So um, thank you. 
Next up, I have this adorable one of Mew Ichigo as well. I absolutely love the simplicity of this, but not only that, I am a sucker for just like the other Mew Ichigo one, just like this one. They have little trinkets and I have a thing for those. I don't know, I just think it adds to the cuteness and I am all about making things cute. So next up, I have this adorable made Ichigo uh, rubber charm. This is official merch. At first, I only had this one, and then eventually, I found all the characters on eBay, and here they are. I am so happy that I found them. So here is Mew Lettuce, and then we have Mew Zakuro, which I, I think she looks adorable here. Oh, and I love mints. This is mint, Mew Mint. I absolutely love mints. Um, as a character and just as merch. I think she's always adorable in the merch uh, as well as Ichigo. Okay, so I think that's all for the Tokyo Mew Mew. I, I feel like I had another Tokyo Mew Mew thing, but I don't know where it is. Oh, I forgot Mew Pudding. I also have Pudding. I don't know how I forgot her, but I think she's adorable as well. She is an absolute baby. Um, and yeah, Mew Pudding. Okay, next up I'm gonna do Sailor Moon. And I surprisingly don't have that much Sailor Moon. I don't know why. I don't know what it is. Literally one of my favorite Magical Girl animes and I like have nothing. I have two Sailor Moon items. So my first one, as just like the new Ichigo one, I bought this one from the same artist with, I don't know if the cat has the same name in the Japanese dub, I forget, but I know her name is Diana in the English dub and again we have the little trinket and the artist did have Usagi but I was running out of cash and I had to pick one more so I am definitely getting Usagi the next time I see the artist at a con. This next one I won on an Instagram giveaway from an artist which I am so happy that I did because look how adorable Usagi is. Um, this is the biggest charm that I have and I love it. I've never owned a charm this big, so it's new, but also it's sparkly and adorable, and I love the star-shaped keyring on there. So, yeah, thank you so much. The artist also sent me, like, a sticker of Usagi's mom, and it's the cutest thing ever. I love it. Next up, we have Cardcaptor Sakura. I don't think I've ever mentioned Cardcaptor Sakura merch on my video, which I don't know why. I have a figure of it, but I don't, I don't, I don't have any official, um, Cardcaptor Sakura charm merch, but all of these ones are fan-made, and they are beautiful. This is the first one. It is by the same artist that has this Ichigo on. Now, while I do love the color pink, I love the red in here so much. If you look here, she has a cute little strawberry charm. And I absolutely adore that with the bow again. Next, I have this adorable double-sided charm and it has a bow as well with a little star in the middle of Sakura on one side, innocent look, and the other side she has this plush-like look. I absolutely love her eyes. I love how they shine. I love how sparkly they look. And there's a little wing as a key ring and I think that's adorable as well. Next up, I have two charms, and they go together. So they look like that on one side, and on the other side, they have a great big smile. <laughs> okay, so that's it for my Sakura charms. Next up, I will show you my Creamy Mommy charms, which I only have one. So that's Creamy Mommy at the front, and then in the back, you have you. Yeah, so I wish I had more Creamy Mommy charms. I think that's what I'm definitely gonna be working on. Or just Creamy Mommy merch. I have this charm and then I have one figure of her. I want a figure of you really bad. Next um, show or series or anime or magical girl anime I have a charm of is Shugo, I always say Chara. I, want, I think, okay, Shugo Kiara. I think that's the right 
way to say it. I don't know. Comment below. Let me know. I don't know. Um, and it is this adorable one. And so this charm is the same artist from the one of Sakura and Ichigo. And again, cute little trinket, cute little bow. All right, the next one I have is Kiki's Delivery Service, which I have two charms of, both fan-made. I buy a lot of things from artists. I usually prefer when I'm going to conventions. Artist merch, I spend most of my time at the Artist Alley. I don't know, I just think they have more to offer and they have more creative things. So this one is double-sided of Kiki. Uh, so there's that. And then on the other side, there's that. <laughs> I'm gonna try to rustle through this because I have a lot more. Uh, and then there is a smaller one that I have of Kiki. That is double-sided, but she has the same face on both sides. Next one I have is from Star Twinkle Pure Cure, which I have not seen. I haven't seen any of the Star, I haven't seen any of the Pre Cure um, anime, but I am planning on it. But I saw this one and I had to get it um, just because I know I'm gonna love her. And that is this one. I didn't even take her out of the packaging because I thought she looked adorable in it. But I just think she is adorable. I don't know her name, but I will know eventually. Oh, and that's official merch as well. So, okay, next series I'm gonna do is not a magical girl one. It is actually, oh, actually, yes. I do have one more magical girl one. <laughs> It is Ojimajo Doremi, and it is just a rubber official charm of Momo, which is one of my favorite Ojimajos in the show, um, next to Doremi. Next is not a magical girl anime, but it is Black Butler. And I will start with the official merch, I think. So first up, I have this I know it's not pink. <gasps> First up, I have this Sebastian charm. I love these. Uh, Tsumamare? I guess that's what like the version of the charms are called. They're Tsumamare um, charms. And they're basically just a bunch of charms from different anime or different Vocaloids too, where they're being pulled from somewhere, either their leg or their clothing. And it's like they're hanging. And I absolutely love that. Um, I do have one of CL, which is right here. I got CL first, and then I was like, oh no, I need a Sebastian one. So I got my Sebastian. Okay, next I have a, another CL rubber charm, and I have Sebastian to go with him, like that. I got these ones a while ago, actually. China. Okay, and then I guess you would hang them next to each other like that. And he's following him and taking his bags. So I thought that was adorable. I got these a really long time ago, actually. Okay, next up I have actually what it is. It's a stand, an acrylic stand that also doubles as a charm. So there's a little punch hole there so you can hang it. It did come with like a chain, but I don't have it right now. But it's of CL eating a little biscuit. And there's that. Oh, and the base can play as a charm as well, and it's just his name. Next, I have my favorite Lizzie charm. She's just in this cute glass bottle, um, and I think she's adorable. I don't have that much Lizzie merch, so I'm really happy that I have this one because this is one of my favorite ones. It's just in there, vibing and waving. I also have a CL one, <laughs> and I think he's adorable, and together, they're a power couple. Okay, we're almost done. The next one I have um, is official merch, and it is of Rin from Vocaloid. And it's basically just Rin hanging around. I have another Tsumamare charm that looks like this. And oh, this is Alba from New Game. I don't know why I didn't even mention that, but I got her, I believe, last year. I think she was the last one. Next, I have blue exorcist charms and these are official charms and or official merch and they also play as both acrylic stands and charms this one is of shiami and that's how she looks um i have a picture of these ones on my instagram and then i also have one of i forgot her name i always forget her name but i have one of her next is 
fan art or fan merch from Miss Kobayashi's Dragon Maid. This is one of my favorite ones. This is Kobayashi and Toru, my wife, my dragon wife, um, and it's double-sided as well. I love this one a lot. A lot of people stand Kama. I stand Kama, but I think Toru overall, ultimately, is my favorite between the two. We have three more. Three more. Next, we have official merch from one of my favorite shoujo anime that I wish I wish we could see more of is uh, Chitoge from Nisekoi. I got her like around the time I first saw the series or fin I think I had just finished the series and I was like, I gotta buy merch, I gotta buy merch. Um, and this was the only thing I got, so I don't know. And if any Nisekoi fans are watching, I am Team Chitoge. Next two aren't really from an anime, but they are acrylic charms. And I really wanted to put in here because I'm absolutely in love with them. I don't know if it's because I recently bought them, but I absolutely love them. And there's no merch. There's like barely any merch of this movie. So yeah, I'm just gonna sneak these in here. We have Joker charms. And I don't really care for that character. I really like Harley more from the Batman animated series. But I am absolutely in love with Joaquin Phoenix's Joker. I am absolutely in love with Joaquin's Joker and I am rambling. But here we have Arthur and we have Jokey Boy. This is Arthur taking his mugshot and then we have Jokey Boy um, in the TV screen. Um, kind of like after he shot Murray Franklin on TV and then took the camera and was like, that's life. Um, and I absolutely love it. But what I even love more about this is Arthur, since he's locked up in Arkham Asylum, he has handcuffs and the handcuffs you can't really see, but it does say freedom on there. And then Joker's charm has his gun that he used that Randall gave him. Huh. That is it. So again, I'm pretty sure I'm missing a few, but this was a lot anyway. Sorry that it was way too long. If it was, I don't know. We'll find out when I edit this. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.